before we get into this shit, I'd just like to direct your attention to NordVPN. That's right, I've sold out. If you make your way to 1201beyond.com backslash DromeVPN, you get 75% off. That's $2.99 a month, people. Why is a VPN important if you follow the sort of content I produce? Region-locked content. A lot of the Z-grade bargain bin trash films that I cover can be hard to find and sometimes even harder to view. Get strapped with a VPN and watch exploitation cinema with ease. That's 1201beyond.com backslash Drome VPN. All right, let's get on with it. Okay, so I'm currently working on a video for this month, and hopefully there's going to be another one coming out. But I had to take a few minutes out of my time to showcase some cool shit that I just got from a, it seems like, local supporter of the show. I did not even know that he watched my content. Um, I've sold him some stuff over over Facebook Marketplace, some like t-shirts, like the horror movie niche action film type shirts and stuff. I threw in a little bit of extra as well, just just for the sake of it. There's a lot of stuff that I really used to like a lot, but that didn't really fit me much anymore. So I wanted it to go to the right home. Um, he's a fellow by the name of Chris. He runs a tattoo shop here in uh, in my hometown. And uh, I just needed to show off some of this awesome shit that he that he gave me. Um, it's it's pretty pretty fucking spectacular. Just a sec. Here here is the uh, here's the first one. It's some sort of dystopian skull helmet thing, almost um, almost like a Boba Fett helmet or something. But it's got like it's got like a skull and like a bat, and it just looks fucking it just looks fucking cool. Like I'm guessing this is a custom work uh, by him. I'm not even sure what it's from or if it's just like a, a random thing, but it looks pretty sweet. Power up! And the second thing I got, I think this one is, um, this is really special. It's, um, it's pretty fucking huge too, so I'm gonna see if I can actually fit it in the frame here, or I might even just go do some, like, individual shots of it up against a wall while I talk about it, but, uh, let's, let's bring this fucker over. It is a hand-painted poster of Art the Clown! I got some weird reflection going on, so yeah, I'm gonna take some individual footage of it while I, like, talk about it, do some layover bullshit audio stuff. Because I can't really do this. Art the Clown is, of course, a great new slasher icon. I'm hoping he becomes a slasher icon that has appeared in films like All Hallows Eve, which is a great little creep show style, Tales from the Crypt style anthology films. It's got all these different types of, of horror films in them, and art is kind of the, the center of it. And he also got his own film, Terrifier, which is absolutely brutal. And the performance, uh, the guy who plays art is just, this guy's fantastic. This guy's like, how expressive he is and how creepy he is. He, to me, he's like a modern Robert Englund or something. Like This guy is totally, this character is like totally Freddy Krueger tier. Just a creepy motherfucker. And it's just, just a brutal survival horror film that takes place over the course of of Halloween night. It's it's just awesome. So I'm pretty proud to have this uh, this kick-ass poster of, of art in my possession. Thanks again, Chris, for all the cool shit. I mean, I don't really know if I if I deserve anything this cool for the, the shirts and some of the memorabilia that I gave you, but I'm happy that, that you like what I sold to you and the things that I threw in. And I'm very, very gracious and very appreciative that you took the time uh, to bring some of this stuff over to me. It's, it's just fucking awesome. Uh, I, I can't wait to throw up old Terrifier back there. I think it's going to be a, a nice nice little uh, addition to the backdrop of the show, I guess. It'll, it'll add a touch of class. New video soon, guys, I promise. I'm, I'm editing it. Should be out before the uh, <sighs> realistically end of the month, but I'm going to try to make it end of the week. Thanks for watching. <laughs>